Hello there, it's uh, Matty4321 bringing you the walkthrough uh, tutorial for Mission 13, which is uh, otherwise known as Whiskey Hotel. I believe we're, well, well, we're the uh, US uh, Marine Corps, I think. Trying to fight its way through uh, war-torn Washington, D.C. I think it's the White House there, isn't it? Am I, am I good with my American place names, yeah? Yeah, anyway, you're not impressed, though. Move it up, you want to dodge behind this car first of all and just um, spray, take out whatever stragglers you can down the left hand side, don't even worry about the right hand side. Uh, there's way too many people over there to even consider shooting that way. So we yeah, concentrate on the left, wait until those guys run forward, then you know it's reasonably safe to, uh, to uh, move. So then you want to dodge and jump into the second uh, little bunker, oh, I might have missed it there a bit. A little bit more wouldn't have hurt still. Uh, just in front of the chopper. And, well, you don't have to do that, but, uh, I am. Hmm. I think I must have just team killed them, never mind. Right, so, um, go out to the left-hand side of the chopper, and go prone, and then you can see under the, uh, rear end of the chopper whilst not exposing yourself too much, just, uh, shoot down there again. And you want to concentrate on the ones on the roof, basically. It's got the sandbags up there, and there'll be four or five enemies behind there. Um, so yeah, just concentrate on them, try and get rid of as many of them as you can before you move forwards. That always helps. Shoot the spotlight if you want, not gonna hurt, but uh, I don't do anything either. Never mind though. So yeah, jump behind the crash jet plane. And do some more spraying. Just like systematically take them out one at a time. And uh, so there, there you go, see there's a guy on top still, so make sure he's gone. So uh, yeah, when you think you've done about as many as you can, you want to sprint to that jeep to the left. Uh, there we go, perfectly timed, as I said it. Um, and yeah, you can just check there's nobody left, which there was, and basically go through the front door. So uh, yeah, that's cool. That's cool. So once you're inside, you get some random message or whatever. And basically, he'll just open the door. And so, um, look down the long end first, you'll see a guy running across, you want to get rid of him first of all. And there's also a guy that comes out from right at the back. And then there he goes, a hole in the wall you look through. And uh, that exposes the least uh, amount of view whilst getting the most of that. So, yeah. Just make sure you clear out every single one. I can't remember when there's, I think it's about 7, 8, 9, 7, 8, I'd say, maybe, total. So, uh, yeah, just do all that. Hmm, didn't see him. <laughs> Spray and pray for the win. Right. Once all them are doing, you can move into the next room. Uh, look around the corner very cautiously. Uh, right, I'm checking grenade. Okay, you might as well want to do the same, because there's quite a couple of them like, grouped together. You get a good number of them. Um, and then just uh, shoot down there. Taking out as many as you can. There you go. Uh, right, now move to the left hand side, look down that little passage where you're trying to get stunned, um, and uh, yeah, just tap the uh, left trigger so you can lock onto them and. Uh, Shoot down there, try and clear as much as you can. Once you think they're all done, which they haven't yet. There you go. So we'd go outside and jump behind this like lovely plant pot that is uh, put there. And uh, yeah, check the left and the right hand side. And these two guys repelling down, they will come up with, they will come to the front eventually, and you can like, take them off anyway. Uh, you want to get rid of them? They got like RPGs and stuff, so they're quite essential to dispose of fairly quickly. Mm -hmm, there you go, got rid of them. Check there's nobody else. Might want to uh, switch your weapon, or check your ammo, or whatever you want to do. Ooh, good gun. Uh, right. Okay, so uh, when you're trying to 
flush out the people in the uh, cubicles over here. You probably want to check a stun, that would uh, help her quite a bit. And yeah, you can. Um, depending on how many you killed earlier, there'll be. I think it's up to about five or six enemies around here. So uh, yeah, just uh, go for them. And uh, you know that when your teammate move forward, you know it's pretty much clear because uh, they don't actually want to do much. So there you go. Okay, looking through there, looking through that doorway, you'll find uh, three enemies originally. That's one down, and then there should be two hiding at the back. One behind the table, and one behind the little pile of crates. Um, yeah, watch out for those because it's quite a confined doorway you're going through, so you get cornered quite easily. And again, once your teammate goes through, you know that it's clear. Okay, so watch this doorway here because there's always a guy that jumps down, and he usually just jumps down and sprays. So uh, be careful of him. Moving up, another guy on the stairs. Um, and then finally, when you go into the last main room, you'll get a grenade checked at you, and you can just lob it back, or you can dodge it. Your choice. Um, but yeah, either way, just spray. Just one thing to remember is when you go in the corner to go to your left, uh, don't forget to shoot him. That one there. Don't forget to shoot him. Uh, and then you pretty much. So it there's another one more guy left and mission complete basically. Okay, so just move upstairs, nobody to kill, just go upstairs and wave your little green stick around. So uh yeah, thank you for watching. Please comment right and subscribe if you haven't already. Subscribe <laughs>